Does God Exist? Ask Paul Rudd, Michael Shannon, Ed Asner, and Kate Arrington, who are facing off in Grace, a divine dark comedy about finding faith. We're here at the Court Theater to celebrate their opening night. What brings you out to Grace tonight? Craig Wright brings me out to Grace tonight. I will, I'll come see him, you know, write a tip on a lunch. We've, we're dying to get a ticket to this. Um, I'm a huge Michael Shannon fan. I'm a huge Ed Asner fan. Uh, Craig Wright. It's just it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be awesome. I'm I'm really really excited for the show. It has got a cast chock full of some of my favorite people. Paul Rudd is amazing. So I'm just excited to see the audience reaction and see all of my favorite Hollywood people up on stage. So tell me why you love this play. What do you love about it? I love that it's about something. It's about very intimate uh, relationship story on a very large canvas. It's Michael Shannon and Paul Rudd duking it out up there. Who do you think is going to win? It's going to be entertaining, I think. Who's going to win? Michael Shannon is bigger and scarier, I think, so maybe him, yeah. I do hear that Paul Rudd takes his shirt off, so what do you uh, what do you think about that? Well, you know, I'd be happy if you took your shirt off, so I'm just happy when anything exciting happens. <laughs> night. Congratulations. How are you feeling right now? Uh, a little bit relieved. Glad it's behind us and ready to have a scotch. <laughs> Opening nights have never been the full flower for me uh, as they should be. And tonight was every bit of it. This cast is crazy. What is it like working with these guys? Uh, it's, a, it's you know, when you're a director with actors, it's a relationship, I don't know, like a coach, teacher, therapist, um, you know, uh, a, a, a flogging block. I mean, I'm everything to these guys, right? I have to really, you know, feel out the relationships between each one. So it's really easy to say it was great working with all four, but each one I had to work with a different way and, and feel what they were feeling and go through the challenges. And I have to say, the one thing that makes directing easy is a fabulous cast, and they made this really, really easy. What is it like being up there in your underwear? How does that feel? I've shown my butt in so many movies that I feel like it's... But it is a little, it is a little strange to be in your underwear in front of a thousand people. The theaters can be a little cold too, so that's kind of nice, you know, because it's late in the, it's late in the show, and I'm already like worked up and and, and kind of exhausted and sweaty. So it's a nice, it's a nice. It's a relief, yeah. Yeah. And what kind of a night am I in for when I come to see this play? Um, I think, you know, confusing and terrifying and um, incredibly funny along the way. <laughs> I think it's a beautiful play. I, this is the second time I've done it. Uh, you know, Craig is a, a brilliant writer uh, and he always manages to tackle a lot of issues uh, while uh, keeping the show entertaining and, and, uh, and moving at the same time. So if God came to see Grace, maybe he was here tonight, I don't know. What do you think he'd say? Uh, he'd say, I had, to, I, I had to come. I couldn't get tickets to Book of Mormon. If there is a God, he blessed us. I think God is always in the theater, and um, I think that's part of why it's a really cool play to me. I think people coming together and listening to something and thinking about something together in harmony is about as close to God as we can hope to get.